Hey guys, up? It's me like a wee three time here, and I'm excited to bring you my first summer 2015 Ultra Agent set review for the Ultrasonic Showdown. This set retails for about 20 US dollars, contains 187 pieces. I got my Toys R Us. Here's a front look at your box. There is the back of the box. This set includes one instruction manual. It has about 56 pages of building. Here is Ultra Agent Curtis Bolt. He can be found in other sets, so he's not really all that special, but his printing is fantastic. He has some great back printing as well and a nice double-sided face, so a very nice minifigure. The main figure you get this set for here is Professor Brainstein. This guy is crazy. He is brick built, which is really, really cool. There's a brand new mold for his helmet piece right there and a really cool printed brain piece using one of those kind of ball joint pieces right there, which is really nice to see. His legs also feature some relatively new pieces that I believe are exclusive to the Ultra Agents line, also seen on Antimatter staff, so those are very cool. All around some great detail. He has a stud shooter on the side right there. Kind of wish there's a stud shooter on the other side because that one side a little bit bare but it's still very nice his torso printing is great his head printing is great and he actually has some nice back printing on his back even though you cannot see it and interestingly it seems like he has the ultra agents logo on his back so i'm wondering if this guy actually worked for the ultra agents and then went bad he's a fantastic minifigure and a great inclusion with this set and you might have already noticed this, but the main mission of this set, the object they need to retrieve, is this walkie-talkie with a sticker right there. That is the main mission of this set. Kind of lame, though. It's actually a sticker, which has a printed tile, but it's still kind of cool. Now, airplanes have been a staple for pretty much every LEGO theme for a very long time at this point. And when I heard the name of this set, I just kind of assumed it was going to be a normal, you know, LEGO jet airplane. This thing is not what I was expecting. This is the most unique LEGO airplane I think they've ever created. There is nothing like this ever been made before in LEGO, and I really applaud that. The front cockpit area here actually looks pretty good. Unfortunately, it's not completely airtight. I was disappointed by that, but there's a cool sticker control panel. You can actually fit the gun on the back right there, which is a nice storage space. And of course, you can put your one Ultra Agent to pilot it, which is very cool. The wings right here are pretty flat designs. I kind of wish they'd been elevated a little bit more, maybe some more tiles, especially around here to make them a little bit thicker. I would have liked that. But the main thing that draws your attention, of course, is this giant cannon right here. They can actually spin 360 degrees around, which is fantastic. And of course, if you twist this right here, you can fire off the studs, rapid fire, which is a really cool play feature. I gotta say, I absolutely love the angles that LEGO got with this vehicle right here. It really reminds me of some stealth bomber type vehicles. It looks very cool. I love the design that they use to make these wings angled. It's great. And actually kind of a cool little thing right here is you can actually pop this piece off and that is going to be your app brick. Now I am not a fan of the app bricks, but I like how this is actually included onto the set. It can connect to the set. It's a pretty cool play feature. And finally you have the ultrasonic engine. This thing looks a little bit ridiculous. These things are really, really high up. This whole thing, it just stands out a little bit too much for my liking. I'm not a big fan of that. All right guys, so I'm over here on the ultrasonic showdown. This is a very unique set. Like I said, there has never been a LEGO jet design quite like this one, and I love that. That being said, something just feels a little bit off. There are lots of studs that are exposed here, which just feels strange for the Ultra Agents theme in general. I imagine things to be a little bit more smooth and sleek. And it just looks a little bit awkward. The big guns and the big jet, they all really stand out. It doesn't really flow together well. It's really flat, and then these things just kind of jut out. It just looks really strange. I do think, however, the price per piece here is great, and the value for the money is also fantastic because the vehicle is actually quite large, which is really great. And, of course, you get the Professor Brainstein figure that looks incredible. It's a, such a great figure to get with this set, and it has some unique molds, which is also really cool. So, all in all, this is definitely a flawed but fun set. I'm going to give it a 7.3 out of 10. But those are just my thoughts. I'd love to hear your thoughts in the comment section down below. Please subscribe to this channel. Subscribe to my video game channel. Also, like this video, favorite the video, and share it with all your friends. And comment on this video as well. Go like me on Facebook. Follow me on Twitter. And follow me on Instagram. And also, please go vote for the LEGO Awards 2015. All these links will be in the description down below. And I hope you see you guys next time. The Portal Ultra Agent Set Reviews. I'll see you guys later. Bye.